Alright guys, the patch 6.1 notes are out, so let's see what changes they did to the Samurai. Let's go to the battle system changes here. So Samurai is right here. Hakaze, potency increased from 180 to 200. So this is plus 20, Jinpu is also plus 20. Third eye effect duration has increased from 3 to 4 seconds. I guess this makes it easier to time for some people, but I don't really see this making a big difference because the players who ask for this probably don't even use third eye in the first place. Shifu plus 20, Gecko is also plus 20. The combo potencies are plus 10. Alright. Higanbana damage over time potency has increased from 30 to 45. Alright guys, so this confirms that Kaitan has been removed. Okay, I guess we have to just move on. Either way, this still means that Higanbana is still in our rotation, so nothing has changed so far. Moving on to Mangetsu, combo potency is plus 10. Kasha is the same as Keiko. Tenka Goken. Area of effect has been changed from a cone before you to all nearby enemies. W what? What the fuck? Why would you do that? Like, you just made the job more simple for no damn reason. Because before you had to time where you had to stand in order. To get all enemies hit but now you're just going to be more brain dead in dungeons what the heck why oh my god this doesn't look good already oka potency increase plus 10 yukikaze is plus 20 combo potency is plus 20 midari setsugeka potency has been reduced from 660 to 600 why? You already removed Kaiten, right? So why is this reduced? Because it's going to lend critical hit and critical hit is like what? 1.4 to 1.5 multiplier, so that's basically what Kaiten added. So it's always going to guarantee a critical hit, but that changes nothing. In fact, this makes it worse for the aesthetic of Samurai because you're no longer going to have that dopamine of getting high damage on one hit. Make your Shisui. Ranged weapon skills no longer count over the effect of this action. Alright, that's a, that's a good quality of life change and a lot of players have been asking for this. Hisatsu Shinten. Previously acquired at 62 so now it is at 52, alright? Sure. Potency has been reduced from 270 to 250. Okay, why reduce this when it is costing you 25 Kenki and Kaiten previously cost you 20 Kenki? I don't, I don't like this. I do not like this. Hisatsu Yatan action. But activation time has been adjusted to match that of other backstep actions? Huh? I guess there was a little delay or something when you use that. Just minor. Kinda whatever. It's quality of life anyway. Hisatsu Kyuten, now acquired at 62. This is complete whatever. Kashi Higanbana, potency reduced. Okay, it's not like we use that anyway. Kashi Goken. Potency reduced from 420 to 280. So basically doing the same as Gokan and the era of effect. Oh, oh my fucking god. What? What are you doing, Square Enix? Kaishi Setsugeka. Potency reduced from 990 to 600. So basically, another Midari. And why? Like. What is this? Even our Kaishi Setsugeka is not going to deal that high damage anymore. Our critical hits will be lower. Shoha potency reduced from 
580 to 500 another reduction excuse me oginomic repotency reduced from 900 to 800 the same goes for kaishinomic carry holy shit Oh my god. Okay, all of this change does not look good. It just seems like it is a nerf. It's definitely not a buff from what I can see. No, the job stays the same. It just looks like a fucking nerf. And I'm sure a lot are not happy about this. Yes, we need to check the final potency numbers, which will be done by the math wizards in the balance. But like... When all of this is reduced and your guaranteed critical hits on here, these plus 20s basically make you that you will have to land critical hits or direct hits on this to get higher damage now. Like, And all these Tengagoken changes making the jobs more simple for people that don't even do savage, like just dumping the jobs down even more. So people who actually do the hard content don't even enjoy it anymore. While the people who already do brain dead content that is not hard at all are getting these changes. And what is this? Like our rotation is most likely going to stay the same, but we are going to have Shintens instead of Kaitens. And uh, Shintens is basically 25 Kenki still. Gear wise, I can't even say right now because critical hits is probably going to still stay a thing to buff all of these guaranteed critical hits, but we might have to shift to speed as well because the actual potency increases are from these skills, so we can get more of these, I guess. What is this, Square Enix? What are you doing? Like, Oh my lord, they just gutted the job from what I see just from these notes, like, none of these changes are good, none of it. Let me know what do you guys think in the comment sections below, because from my perspective, I am not happy about this, like, I'll just keep this video short, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys again when there are more changes that I see that are significant enough. Holy shit though, like, uh, whatever.